If you are liking these videos, please give us a thumbs up. And but if you don't like them, please do this. <laughs> give them a thumbs down. <laughs> Hi, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be unboxing a kiwi crate. And every time these come in the mail, my five-year-old gets so excited. He just can't wait and he wants to know what it is. So I'm excited to let him be able to do the craft this month. So if you're new to my channel, I created this channel as a homeschooling resource to give you unboxings like I'm doing today to provide you with different curriculum ideas, some organizational ideas, and just how we make it through our homeschool life. So if you're interested in those things, please hit that subscribe button below, and let's get into this box. So this month is Rainbow Optics, and it says make a color-changing lantern and play with mixing colors of light. So that sounds very exciting with the rainbows. My kids love rainbows, or creating rainbows. So that's what it looks like when we open it up. And it has our instructions on the top. So it looks like they have some little cool glasses and the lantern they're gonna make. I think that's what it said. So these, I think this is just the instructions in here. So it has a few different things that they're going to be able to do, as we can see there. And then here's the booklet that's going to talk to us more about rainbows and rainbow optics, I'm sure. So it always has a little story at the front with these little funny looking creatures. And then it gives you some more things like where to find rainbows and then some things you can do with your project to just get different effects from it. And then there might there's even a connect the dots picture. So these booklets are really, really great if you wanna expound upon the crate. So in here we have foam. <laughs> I think that's what, it has some little, has foam on the top and bottom, but then styrofoam in the middle. So I'm not sure what that's going to be for. And then we have a little jar, probably for the lantern. So we'll see about that. We have our glasses. Should I put them on? Whoa, everything is rainbows. So those are exciting. Hopefully they don't get ripped really quick with my kids. <laughs> And then we have some little stickies and Velcro looking things. This is a little wooden piece. And then we have this, it has some different colors inside. So I don't know what all these things are gonna be used for. And lots of little light clickers it looks like, some different colors and here's, here's more. So that'll be fun. And then just a big, <laughs> square right here or a diamond and then a marker it looks like a dry erase marker and then we have i don't know what this is guys this crate is full of a lot of things that i just don't even know what they are so this is just kind of paper it's a little bit see-through then we have some stickers like some sea animals but there's space as well so i don't know about that either and then let's see this looks like the last thing i don't know what this is it's just a big piece of paper i'm just excited to see what all this stuff is for because it just seems like so many little random pieces so i'm gonna let my son get at this and i will let you know how it goes <laughs> finished his kiwi crate and we're excited to show some of the projects with you so he's gonna hold up the first one <laughs> can you see it <laughs> so this is it's rainbow optics so this is what we're doing and <laughs> you can see the light change as you turn it so we already turned the lights on you can see them in here and you put the lid on and there's this little container he was able to decorate with stickers that came in the crate and so it only shines the light through this little hole and so even though there's three colors in there, as that light just comes through, it mixes the colors and it changes. So I thought that was really cool. 
and you can go into it more in depth depending on your child if you want to talk about it more or if that's sufficient for them then you don't need to talk about it more and there's rainbow glasses we're talking about the rainbow glasses next are you gonna put them on so it explains a little bit about the rainbow glasses and how the plastic is special and it breaks the white light into color so that's why when you look through them you see a whole bunch of rainbows and so i thought that was really cool and then the last thing that he made is a projector and so this is part of it we'll insert a clip of what it actually looks like because it's pretty big once you roll it all out but you're able to take this part right here is velcro and it comes with a dry erase marker mm -hmm. and you can erase the back and write something so he wrote his siblings names and mom and dad on here and then you can put the velcro on and then you flash light through it and it projects way. I know. hold on one second it projects onto this side so that was really cool as well and i thought it was a lot of fun did you like drawing on here mm -hmm. so and what this is was water you didn't have hold on and then you do a mirror then you flash the light and then make a rainbow there you go he's gonna tell you everything so in here again there's some additional activities with showing how rainbows are made you could do and then usually this one has a food activity you can do. It's a snack. Yeah, so it has a snack. So it has little rainbow fruit skewers you could do since you're talking about rainbows. And then it also talks about the difference. Hold on, we've already shown that. It talks about the difference between paint mixed together and light mixed together and how paint is black and then light is white when mixed together. So I thought just all the things were pretty cool and I haven't had a chance to go through everything, but if you wanted to, to do a really good lesson about rainbow optics and just light in general, I feel like this is a really what? good crate. It's so what was- showing it. Okay. Now I'm showing the rainbow. What's your favorite part? Can you tell him what your favorite part was? He's very distracted by these lights. Okay, what was your favorite part? Um, Look over at the camera and tell him. Um, I got to go to music. <laughs> no, your favorite part about this crate, not your favorite part about your day. <laughs> Did you have a favorite part? Don't no. Know. Okay. What was the hardest part? Um, nothing. Nothing. But this crate was actually pretty easy for him to do by himself. Even the instructions were pretty straightforward and there wasn't a whole lot of stuff that required a lot of really but who didn't let me do this okay i did that one huh there wasn't a lot of really fine strong like motor skills that were needed so he was able to do a lot of it himself so that was really fun for him but overall i think we really enjoyed it and i thought it was cool for them to just see how rainbows are made and then when you mix all red and blue and green light together. It is creating something black on the screen. It projects something and you're able to see it. So I thought that was really cool as well. So we're really excited to see what next month brings. And so again, if you are liking these videos, please give us a thumbs up and we will see you next time. But if you don't like them, please do this. <laughs> give them a thumbs down. Okay, bye.